Reverse 1999, we're back with Ezra. I pulled this boy, and yes, boy, a few days ago. And wow, it's his inside one slash inside zero art is just okay. The one at the inside two is great. You have midriff that's trying to hide behind those hands. Not only do you have belly button, but you have the beginnings of a V-line. I approve wholeheartedly. Look at that. Wonderful. The entire reason I pulled for him. And finally, my roster of submissive and breedable characters is complete. Ezra, 37. Spithodia. I'm seeing a tummy based theme here with those two. Ulu. X. Ego. Difficultly her. Alongside Lasaurus, who honestly deserves more appreciation. I mean, she's already wet. Why not? Charlie. And Eric. I mean, you already have the thighs. And those shorts are so wide, you can realistically just put your hands up there. Cristala also deserves some appreciation. I mean, look, she's adorably cute and is deserving of the most gentle of breeding. And whilst the grind to get certain characters to Inside 3 is insane, especially when said characters unlock some very good and very large passives, it's a little bit annoying. But either way, I still recommend this game. It's fun. And so whether you're aiming for submissive and breedable characters, fun gameplay, a good story, even though you might have missed some previous events, but that will be remedied much later on during the Annie, I can recommend Reverse. I would like to note that Anniversary will be coming up soon, under which case a bunch of new things will be added more than likely alongside some goodies, but you can check the Reverse 1999 subreddit if you're interested in that. Or just be like me and pull for the characters you think are hot. Lilia was an accident, as was Sotheby, and I think despite this game being one where I have all the characters I want, it's a game where I have wailed the least. I would like to keep in mind though that this is a very much a side game. It does not have enough content or enough stuff for you to do for it to be a main game, especially given that the things that you want to do would likely cost. So this is going to be a very quick login for 5 to 10 minutes, or maybe 20 to an hour in the event that you're just starting out, and then log off. It resets an hour after Genshin's reset, which is also HSR's reset, and an hour before Arknight. But if you enjoy Ezra, then subscribe. If you enjoy any high character, then subscribe.